morning to the honorable judges, loving teachers, fellow contestants, and audience. My name is Naomi Yang Dutrin, and I am going to tell you a story titled A Bridge of Rainbow. Legend has it that there was a royal fairy prince who was very fond of coming down to earth to play in the garden where there were lots of beautiful flowers. He came down on a horse accompanied by his royal escorts. Whenever he came, he brought with him a golden bucket. Every time when he was tired, he would bathe at the well nearby. He would use the golden bucket to fetch the water which was very cool. Every time after his bath, he felt refreshed. Ah, what a refresh! said the prince while stretching his body. One day, while bathing, he suddenly heard somebody singing in such a beautiful, melodious voice. I'm a big, big girl in a big, big world. It's not a big, big thing if you wish me. He looked everywhere for the singer, but he couldn't see anyone. He saw a very beautiful princess. She was playing with some of her escorts not far from where the prince was bathing. He was so captivated by her beauty that the golden bucket had dropped out of his hand. When he realized what had happened, he began looking for the golden bucket. He looked and looked, but the golden bucket could not be found. His royal escorts jumped into the well to try to find the golden bucket. But they couldn't find the golden bucket. Finally, they had to return to their fairyland empty-handed. Ever since that day, whenever the prince thought of the missing golden bucket, he would come down to earth to look for the missing golden bucket. He would come down alone. There were no more royal escorts. The people on earth knew the time when the prince would come down to earth. It was a wonderful sign from the clouds to earth. It was a bridge of rainbow with the most beautiful colours. It is said that even the clouds were sad about the missing golden bucket, so they sent a drizzle. When it was drizzling, a bridge of rainbow would be formed. So the prince would descend into the earth to find the missing golden bucket. Now, my dear friends, what do you think is the moral value of this story? Do not get distracted by other temptations. When you do something, do it with all your heart. With that, I end my story. Thank you.